What is the first thing you think about when you hear the word Sunday? When it comes to me, the first thing I think of when I think of Sunday is church. That's not, however, the first thing that I want to do on Sunday. I'd rather put a pipe on my e-brake and see if this will give me enough leverage to lock up the rear end on the big money waster. We worked on the BMW yesterday, you guys loved it. You guys also gave me a lot of good answers for yesterday's question, what was your to what was your favorite toy between the ages of five and 10? You guys helped me bring back a couple memories of my own as well. Saying that, don't forget to answer today's question. Just scroll down a little bit, come back up, watch the video. Yeah, it looks like it tried. I have some black there, and I have some black there. The only trouble is I don't have that much of a runway right here. Got a car there, got a garage there. That'll probably work though. <laughs> the thing that I love the most about the summer is the parties, events, and get-togethers. Today, I'm happy to say that we are going to have a get-together. A family get-together. I love family get-togethers. I have to do an oil change on the Duramax. And Greg sent this to me a long, long time ago. Greg, I really do apologize, but it's always better late than never. He sent me a remote for the Duramax, so I figured I could do an oil change. We could install this remote if this actually works. I'm getting sick of my alarm going off. Of course, it won't go off right now, but it does go off a lot. And it kind of catches me off guard sometimes, and sometimes I'm near people, and it's just not good. Greg, we're installing your remote. We just had a bird fly through here. Here comes you guys. How's it going, buddy? I love my garage. Here you go. Really? <laughs> I was I was having difficulties with it. I didn't think that was gonna work. Lock. It is locked. <laughs> Greg, Greg, you're the man, thank you. Are you kidding me? That's awesome. Yep, that works too. I'm getting ready to drain my oil, but I'm thinking about today's question. When I said Sunday, did anybody think ice cream? I'm kinda hungry for some ice cream now. This thing holds 10 quarts, it's gonna take a while. Because I didn't start up my truck and let it run and have hot oil, I'm going to let it sit a little longer than usual, but there are a couple things that I wanna show you guys and talk to you about. So the first thing is the engine oil life is at 53%. You can see that right there. I'm going to reset that. This year notifies you when you need to change your oil. The last time I listened to it, I, I regretted it. It went way too many miles. I know there aren't that many people that use this maintenance sheet. This is the first vehicle I've ever used it for. So here's today, I'm doing an oil change and I'm also changing this small tranny filter. Who was the chair? Yes, the chair. Which is right here. So for this oil change, I put 4,200 miles on. I think that's an appropriate spot to change the oil. That handy dandy thing, I like it. As you can see, I have a magnetic oil plug. This is just something that is supposed to work. I installed it on the KX, the KX didn't do so hot. Hopefully this prevents any Duramax problems. And then lastly, um, it's nice having your truck undercoated because it doesn't rust up here in New York State. But when it comes to getting under it and touching it, you get kind of dirty. That's the only thing. There are pros and cons to everything. Everything! Got my nice new shirt all dirty. finish up my part of recycling oil before I go to my family's party. I'm really looking forward to it.
I made it up to my aunt's house. You gotta see Rex the dog. Rex, come here. All you need is this ball right here. Rocco, I gotta record you every time I see you because it's a blessing that we still have you. Yeah. Oh, good boy. Oh, good boy. You're looking good at your old age. Ah! You guys are like Robin Big, but the opposite, because you're because you're black and you're little and he's white and he's big. So you guys are opposite to Robin Big. 